Welcome to Jumpstart. Please type your name in the box, or if you've been here before, just click your name. It's time for the Big Jumpstart Scooter Tournament. The grand prize is a totally tricked out super scooter and a <laughs> squirt. I was just riding on that trail and that mean old Jimmy Bumples pushed me. I fell and broke my scooter. Look, Skid, we don't have to worry about any of them beating us in the scooter tournament. They don't even have scooters that work. Jimmy, you should fix Squirt's scooter. You pushed him. I'm not fixing anything. You need to stay out of the way. Huh. Look, guys, I know Jimmy has never lost, but we've got to get that scooter for Squirt. We're just gonna have to train and practice and invent our own scooter gadgets so that we can beat Jimmy at the tournament. Hello, welcome to Jumpstartville. With your help and the help of everyone here in Jumpstartville, we'll show Jimmy Bumples that we don't have to cheat to win the scooter race. Everyone has their own house and there's so much to do when you visit them. There's the Jumpstartville Arena, home of the world famous championship scooter races. Next to it is the scooter design shop where we can add gadgets to our scooters. And there's the track design tower too. The toolbar has everything you need to help you get around. That back arrow button will take you back to the last place you visited. This button will allow you to open up the toolbar or move it back out of the way. The question mark is the help button. So click around and explore or pick a house and start earning power-ups for the scooter rings. It's gonna be a lot of fun and we're going to win. Hold your mouse over any of the buildings on this screen and I'll tell you what goes on there. That's Edison's landscaping store. You can buy cool stuff to put next to your tracks. Let's go shopping! Glad you stopped by my humble little shop. I've been doing a lot of business with the races coming up and all those tracks need decorations. You can buy fountains, benches, light poles, and other lovely things here. Of course, the machine only takes exact change, but that shouldn't be a problem. If you need to make change, drag a coin back to me piggy bank. Click the item that costs 27 cents. Balloons, 27 cents. How can you start paying when you haven't clicked the item to buy? Whoa, slow down. You need to click the item to buy before balloons. Balloons, right. Penny. Nickel. 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 Penny, 27 cents. Ooh, that's quite a bargain, I must say. Now move it to a track that you like. Balloons, balloons. Why don't we place that on a track? Balloons. As I live and breathe, Eleanor is going to be tickled pink when she sees that by her track. Great job. Now you only need to buy three more track decorations. Click the item that costs 18 cents. Good choice, if I say so myself. Now we have to pay for it. Drag the coins into the machine. Nickel. 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 Penny. Penny. Nickel. Penny. 18 cents. You're a great little shopper. Pick a track to put that on and let's go. What are you waiting for? The product is yours. Put it on the track before someone else comes along and grabs it. Str street lamp. Won't Eleanor love that special touch to her track? Two down, two to go. Click 
the item that costs nine cents. Good choice, if I say so myself. Now we have to pay for it. Drag the nickel. Penny. 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 Nine cents. You're a great hot air balloon. I'll make sure Frankie knows you picked that out for his track yourself. I see by the lights that you've only got to buy one more product before you get a power-up. Click the item that costs 26 cents. That's the one. Now put the right amount of change in the machine. Nickel. 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 Penny. 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 Twenty-six cents. You've a can of seashells. Oh, what a perfect accent for Pierre's track. Oh, what a fine job you've done. You've got four lovely decorations for the track. How's it feel to know you've earned that power up by your own labors? So what'll it be then? Off for more games and adventures? Or would you be willing to stay here and shop for more fine greenery? I think we could use the bag of snowflakes. I think we could use the bag of snowflakes. Bag of snow. That's the dime. 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 Nickel. Dime. Penny. 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 Eighteen cents. That's the ticket. Move it down to a track and see what's bag of snowflakes. Won't that look nice on Casey's track? Great job! Now you only need to buy three more track decorations. A can of seashells is just what we need now. Where we can of seashells. Can of Dime. Dime. Nickel. Penny. Penny. 27 cents. Can of seashells. If my friendship with CJ has taught me anything, it's taught me enough to know he's going to love that for his track. Two down, two to go. We should buy the pine tree. Pine tree. Six. Right. It's time to check out. Put the correct coins in the nickel. Penny. Six cents. Pi Keisha loves things like that. So she's going to be thrilled to see what you've done for her track. I see by the lights that you've only got to buy one more product before you get a power up. Why don't you buy the flower mound? Air balloon. Eight cents. Television. Forty-three cents. Flower mound. F Good choice, if I say so myself. Now we have to dime. 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 Nickel. Nickel. Penny. 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 Forty-three cents. You're a flower mound. Oh dear, Hops is so excitable. I think he's going to hop into orbit when he sees his track. Oh, what a fine job you've done. You've got four lovely decorations for the track. Marvelous work, my friend. You've shopped your way to another electric light bulb power-up. Business has been sort of slow, so if you want to stay a while longer, I'll be glad of the company. Welcome back. We're still in shock over the way Jimmy Bumples broke Squirt's scooter just before the big race. I'm sure glad we have you on our team to help us earn power-ups. I know we can win. Time to get our scooters in gear.
This is the workshop where, thanks to our resident genius, Hopsalot, you can turn all the power-ups you've earned into cool gadgets for your scooter. First, you need to pick a scooter. Then you can soup it up with Hop's crazy inventions. Collect all eight gadgets for a scooter, and you're sure to win the race. Hey, we're gonna need that power-up. Don't put it over there. First, you have to pick a scooter. Click a picture of one of our friends up there. Click here to pick Keisha's good choice. Ready to add some gadgets? Careful where you put your power-ups. Jimmy Bumples might try to swipe it. Jimmy Bumples is gonna cry when he sees that light shield on your scooter. Click here to make the gadget. Click here to make the gadget. What a gadget! Now snap it onto your scooter. That gadget goes perfectly there. Go back, Arrow. I wonder what other gadgets we could make. Do you want to... Scooter fever is running wild in Jumpstartville as we get our scooters and tracks ready to race. Click on any building so you can start earning power-ups. Are you ready for the big race? Start your engines! Here we are at the arena. Can you feel the excitement? We've got to take care of a few things before we race. You can click a statue of me or one of our friends up there to race with. Then click on a track like the starter track above me or the ones over there. We can't race without a scooter driver. Now let's pick someone. I won't steer you wrong. That's the starter track where you can practice your moves. You've got your racer. Now you need to choose a track. Now that track isn't ready yet. Remember, you need all eight tricks to unlock it. We'll need to add more tricks to that track before it's unlocked for the races. Yeah, I want to show Jimmy we can win on his turf too. But we have to beat him on all the other tracks before we can race on his. All right, back to the old drawing board. Let's add another gadget to one of the scooters. That'll be a perfect scooter to add some gadgets to. Jimmy Bumples is gonna cry when he's... What a gadget! Now, snap it onto your scooter. That gadget goes perfectly there. Scooter fever is running wild. Keisha's place. How creative. Oh, hi. I'm hoping that you want to play some artistic games. I've got a couple of amazing ones here. You can paint pictures that will decorate the racetracks over there. Or you can create card shows that combine art and music there. Great! I'm so excited to hear your music. Card shows are so cool. It's where music and pictures come together. Click on the instruments in the pictures you want to use. Then drag them to the big show board. Use the scroll arrows to see more of your project. You can play your production by clicking the play button down there. You'll also see the floppy disk button to save your piece, the album button to find a piece you saved before, or the trash can so you can delete your piece. Instruments in the top row play the melody. Try different ones for each part of the song on the big board. Flute. Oops, remember that has to stay in the same row. Flute. We can list flute. Flute. I see what you're doing, and it's great. Interesting choice. I can't wait to hear it. Tip. 
timpani. Timpani. That's just the place. Click on the right arrow button to scroll over to the right. <laughs> Where else? Oboe. Oboe. Clarinet. Clarinet. Snare. Snare. Triangle. Triangle. I see what you're doing, and it's great. Interesting choice. I interesting choice. I can't wait to hear it. Click the trash button if you don't. What a great work of art. Here's your magic pink tube power up. Aren't you dying to listen to your music? Click the trash button if you don't want to keep your musical piece. Want to save this show? Boy, with this card show playing, that's going to be quite a celebration in the winter circle. We don't have to stop now. We can put together another show if you like. Clarinet. Bassoon. Violin. Cello. Guitar. Harp. Trumpet. French horn. Triangle. Wood blocks. Symbol. Cowbell. That's just the place. That's just the place. That's just the place. That's a great spot. I can feel it. Interesting choice. That's a great spot. That's just the place. That's just the place. Shaker. Click on the right arrow button to scroll over to the right. <laughs> Shaker. You've earned another Magic Paint 2 power-up with that display of musical genius. Aren't you dying to listen to your music? that they'll play in the winter circle. And I can say, I watched you create it. Sure, you can take your reward back to Hop's workshop, but wouldn't you rather make another card show? Shaker. Bass. Timpani. Snare. Triangle. 
Triangle, triangle, triangle. Trombone, trombone, trombone. Trombone. That's a great spot. Interesting choice. I see what you're doing. Click on the left arrow to scroll over to the left. I see what you're do. I see what you're doing, and it's great. That's just the place. That's a great spot. I can feel it. Tuba. 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 You've earned another Magic Paint 2 power-up with that display of musical genius. Aren't you dying to listen to your music? Want to save this show? Boy, with this card show playing, that's going to be quite a celebration in the winner circle. So, do you want to play again or not? Flute. 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 Triangle. 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 That's a great, interesting, interesting choice. Click on the right arrow button to scroll over to the right. <laughs> Where else? Oboe. 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 Symbol. 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 That's just the play. That's just the play. That's a great spot. Interesting choice. I can't wait to hear it. Click the play button and then we'll listen. What a great work of art. Here's your magic pink tube power up. Aren't you dying to listen to your music? I know you will. There's a big to-do in the winner circle. Your card show will play as part of the celebration. It's exciting. So, do you want to play again or not? Oh, wait. Before you move on, do you want to save this show? We could play again, though. Click here if you want to go back to my paint studio. Let's put more items on the... Okay, now click the easel or the winner's circle. Okay, now click the easel or... Oh, good. Let's polish this show up and get it exactly the way you want it, big board. Oh, wait. Drag more items to the big board or click the save button to save your work so far. Scooter Fever is running wild in Keisha's place. How creative. I'm glad you're back. Okay, let's paint. This is 
where I keep all my paints and canvases to create beautiful art for the racetracks. You can paint whatever you can imagine. You can paint cards for the winner's circle, or you can paint billboards. Later, when you're racing, you'll see your billboards on the tracks. So, you need to figure out if you want to paint billboards to hang by the track, or if you want to paint a card show picture, which can be played with music in the winner's circle. So, you want to paint a billboard? Okay. Use the paint, put some paint here, and then put a different color in the other spot to mix them. And use the paintbrush or the paint can to put a color here, and then do the same in the other spot. That's how we mix colors. Wait, you're doing so many. So, you need. So, you want. So, you want to paint a billboard? Okay. Use the paintbrush or use the paintbrush or the paint can to put a cup. Put some paint here and then put a different color. Now drag the sticker to the canvas. Now drag the sticker to the canvas. Wait, before you go. Click. Wait, you're doing so, so, so. You want to paint a billboard? Okay. Now drag the sticker to the canvas. the sticker to the canvas. Blue. Put use. Sure, that's a nice color. You can make it completely new. Whoa, that's such a light blue. shelf with items that let you do important stuff like print, save, and open saved pictures. Beautiful! We'll keep that piece here in the album. Wait! So, so, you want to paint a billboard? Okay! Now drag the sticker to the canvas. What a gorge pink! Wait! You just made that color by mixing others. We can't mix it again. Beautiful! We'll keep that piece here in the album. Undo the last thing you did. Wait, before you go, let's go to the music room. I'm totally ready to make another card show. It's a good thing you came back, because we're still getting ready for the scooter races. So, where do you want to go now? Let's play soccer! Hey, Casey! Your soccer stadium's great! Hiya, Frankie! My teammates and I are practicing for the big game. Would you like to coach us? Sure, we can help. Use the arrow keys to help Casey move to the correct soccer ball. Hit the space bar to grab the ball. Then, kick it to the player with the letters that form the word we're looking for. Grab the ball that displays the following sound. 
You sure got a piece of that one. Kick the ball to the player that displays the following sound. Op. Hop. Great shot! Now find the rhyme for hop. Perfect pass! Now find the rhyme for mop. Oh no! He blocked that kick! I sure got a piece of that one. Now find the rhyme for pop. Goal! Grab the ball that displays the following sound. Wh you sure got a piece of that one. Kick the ball to the player that displays the following sound. Ig. Wig. Perfect pass. Now find the rhyme for wig. Perfect pass. Now find the rhyme for big. Perfect pass. Now find the rhyme for dig. Goal! Grab the ball that displays the following sound. <laughs> Fancy footwork. Kick the ball to the player that displays the following sound. N. Great shot! Now find the rhyme for ten. Perfect pass! Now find the rhyme for den. Fancy footwork! Now find the rhyme for men. Grab the ball that displays the following sound. Puh. You sure got a piece of that one. Kick the ball to the player that displays the following sound. Et. Pet. Perfect pass. Now find the rhyme for pet. You sure got a piece of that one. Now find the rhyme for met. Great shot! Now find the rhyme for get. Goal! Here's your game ball power up. This ball will kick your scooter into gear. you want to roll out of here or win another game ball? Grab the ball that displays the following sound. Mmm. Fancy footwork. Kick the ball to the player that displays the following sound. Add. That's not the shot you were supposed to take. Mad. You sure got a piece of that one. Now find the rhyme for mad. Great shot! Now find the rhyme for bad. You sure got a piece of that one. Now find the rhyme for dad.
grab the ball that displays the following sound. You sure got a piece of that one. Kick the ball to the player that displays the following sound. At. It came out of nowhere. Cat. You sure got a piece of that one. Now find the rhyme for cat. Great shot! Now find the rhyme for bat. Fancy footwork! Now find the rhyme for fat. Goal! Grab the ball that displays the following sound. Fancy footwork! Kick the ball to the player that displays the following sound. Ig. Wig. Fancy footwork! Now find the rhyme for wig. Perfect pass! Now find the rhyme for big. Perfect pass! Now find the rhyme for dig. You shoot! You score! Grab the ball that displays the following sound. <laughs> you sure got a piece of that one. Kick the ball to the player that displays the following sound. It. Kit. Perfect pass! Now find the rhyme for kit. Great shot! Now find the rhyme for Great shot! Now find the rhyme for Pit. You shoot! You score! You showed some great moves out there. This game ball will really power up our scooters for the races. If you want to quit the game, use the go back arrow on the tool. We can stay here and win another game or move on. It's up to you. Grab the ball that displays the following sound. Sn. Close. Hmm. I'm thinking of a word that rhymes with think. Drink! That's right. Both of these words have the same ending spelling. You'll find a lot of that with words that rhyme. Pink! Keep close. I'm sure we'll be back to win more Game Ball power-ups later. For now, we're out of here. It's a good thing you came back, because we're still getting ready for the scooter races. So, where do you want to go? Eleanor's got all the latest news. Hello, and welcome to the Jumpstart Bill News Network. I'm Eleanor. <coughs> I'm just practicing for my news report. It's terribly busy here in the studio, and I could use another reporter to help me write my news stories. I'll provide four story ideas. I need you to choose a topic, research it, and then help me write a news report about it. Can you help me? Here are four story leads. Surely one of them interests you. Web page. Keisha's All About Insects page. Welcome to Keisha's All About Insects page. Some people think bugs are creepy, but I think they're beautiful. Insects are very tiny animals. I have one pet insect, a beetle. All insects have six legs. Spiders are not insects. Spiders have eight legs. Butterflies are insects. Butterfly wings have pretty colors. 
Ants and bees are insects. They live in big groups. Bees make honey. Yum. People have hard bones inside, but insects do not have bones. Their hard part is outside. Some other insects are beetles and grasshoppers. Flies and termites are insects too. I love to draw pictures of blue beetles. People have hard bones inside. Now it's time to write four sentences for the report. I'll ask a question, and you drag tiles up to the writing board to make sentences that answer the question. How many legs do insects have? Six legs. Careful, we need to keep insects. Have six legs. Oh, you captured what we need to say. Are spiders insects? Spiders are not insects. I don't think that punctuation mark works with that sentence. Let's try another punctuation mark. Are not insects. You are a hard-hitting journalist. What are flies? Flies are dog. Reporters need to stick to the facts. And I don't see our insect. You have a nose for news. What does Keisha draw? Keisha. Blue draws beetles. Let's try to draw blue beetles. We're going live with this story. Insects have six legs. Spiders are not insects. Flies are insects. Keisha draws blue beetles. <coughs> couldn't have met my deadline without you. Please accept these power peanuts as a token of my appreciation. We're gathering more news, so I'd be most appreciative if you stayed to help put the stories together. But I understand that you have other obligations. Web page. Storybook. Mr. Popularity. Frankie the dog is Mr. Popularity. Everybody likes him. He has many friends. One day, Pierre the bear said, I want to be popular like you. What's your secret, Frankie? It's no secret, said Frankie. I like to be treated right, so I'm nice to others. Is that all? asked Pierre. I don't cheat when I play games, and I share toys and books with my friends. If you I can do that, said Pierre. Sure you can, Pierre. It's easy to get along if you try. Then Pierre ran to the park to make new friends. It's good to take your time to absorb all this information. If you finished reading this page, click on the arrow to scroll to the next page. Click. Looking for news in the rest of Jumpstartville. Welcome back. We're Eleanor's got all the latest news. This just in. There's enough news in Jumpstartville to keep me busy around the clock. I need you to choose, research, and write a story for tonight's news. Let's get to work. If we finish the story in time, I can air a Power Peanuts commercial, and the sponsor will reward you. Here are four story leads. Surely one of them interests you. Storybook. Edison gets ready for a fire. Edison saw CJ on a ladder in the hall. What are you doing, he asked. I'm testing the smoke alarm, said CJ. If a fire ever comes, I'll be ready. I want to be ready too, said Edison. What can I do? To prepare for a fire, you need to make an escape plan, said CJ. Look for any door or window you could use. Remember, in a fire, smoke goes up, said CJ. The air is best near the floor, so stay low or crawl. If a door feels hot, do not open it. I'll remember, said Edison. Get out as fast as you can, CJ said. Do not hide inside. Hey, CJ, why don't we go visit the fire station, asked Edison. Great idea, said CJ. The fire station has new yellow fire trucks. 
CJ and Edison met firefighters, and they saw a white dog with black spots. The fire chief gave Edison some books about fire safety. CJ and Edison were very happy. Edison, CJ asked, why don't we go home and finish our fire escape plan? They went home and lived safely ever after. If you want to quit the game, use the go back arrow on the toolbar. I'll remember, said Edison. Get out as fast as you can, CJ said. Do not hide inside. Hey, CJ, why don't we go visit the fire station, asked Edison. Great idea, said CJ. The fire station has new yellow fire trucks. CJ and Edison met firefighters, and they saw a white dog with black spots. The fire chief gave Edison some books about fire safety. CJ and Edison were very happy. Edison, CJ asked, why don't we go home and finish our fire escape plan? They went home and lived safely ever after. Click the close button or anywhere on the screen if you'd like to get back to the newsroom. Now it's time to write four sentences for the report. I'll ask a question, and you drag tiles up to the writing board to make sentences that answer the question. What did CJ do on the ladder? CJ. Tested the smoke alarm. You are a hard-hitting journalist. How did Edison get ready for a fire? Edison. Made an escape plan. Oh, you captured what we need to say. Should you open a hot door in a fire? Do not open. Do not open. A hot, hmm, that punctuation will confuse me. A hot, oh, you captured what we need to say. What did CJ and Edison visit in the story? They. Visited the fire station. Now that's a great news story. CJ tested the smoke alarm. Edison made an escape plan. Do not open a hot door. They visited the fire station. Your story was really concise, to the point. I hope you'll accept these power peanuts as my thank. We're gathering more news, so I'd be most appreciative if you stayed to help put the story Encyclopedia. The plants. There are millions and millions of plants on Earth. They are found in every corner of the globe. Plants are living things. Most plants grow from seeds planted in the Earth, but some do not. Water lilies live in water, and orchids grow up in trees. Most plants have roots, a stem, leaves, and flowers or fruit. Roots take food for the plant from the soil. The stem holds the plant up. Leaves turn sunlight into food for the plant. And flowers or fruit make seeds for more plants. It's good to take your time. Plants are important to humans and animals. They provide foods like fruit, nuts, and vegetables. Trees give us wood for building. Plants, trees, and flowers also add beauty to our lives. Are plants living things? Plants are living. You have a nose for news. What holds plants up? Stems hold plants up. Oh, you captured what we need to say. What do most plants grow from? Most plants Grow from seeds. You have a nose for news. What do leaves do for plants? Leaves. Turn sunlight into food. We're going live with this store. Plants are living things. Stems hold plants up. Most plants grow from seed. Leaves turn sunlight into food. 
the sponsors will be more than happy to reward you with these power peanuts as a thank you for getting their commercial on the air. Do you want to stay here and write the news or go out there and make the news? Newspaper. Local boy rushed to hospital. On Monday, Jason Brown hurt his arm playing football. Coach Clark knew he had broken a bone and called for help. Soon, Jason was taken to the hospital in an ambulance. Jason was afraid of the hospital, but everyone was very nice to him. Nurse Gonzalez took an x-ray of Jason's arm. The x-ray showed where his arm was broken. Next, Dr. Kanekabe set the broken bone and bandaged it. Nurse Gonzalez gave Jason a lollipop. Then, they sent Jason home with some medicine for the pain. Jason is now doing fine, but Jason won't be playing football for quite a while, Coach Clark said. What was Jason doing when he got hurt? Jason was football. That's brilliant! That sentence is going into our store. Who called for help? The teacher. Help. It's a good sentence, but it just doesn't provide the end. Coach, you have a nose for news. Who took an x-ray of Jason's arm? Nurse. Gonzalez. Arm. That's brilliant! That sentence is going into our store. What kind of candy did Jason get? Jason. Uh, lo let's try lollipop. It's time for us to share this story with our viewer. Jason was playing football. The coach called for help. Nurse Gonzalez x-rayed Jason's arm. Jason got a lollipop. We got the commercial on the air in time. Here's your reward. I hope you know that journalists work for Power Peanuts. More story ideas are coming into the newsroom all the time. Do web page. Pierre's good food page. Welcome to Pierre's web page. It's all about good food. Good food helps us grow strong and healthy. I eat the right kinds of food and the right amount of food. The food guide pyramid tells how much to eat. I eat more food from the bottom of the pyramid. I eat less food from the top. Grains are at the bottom. Some grain foods are bread, rice, and cereal. I eat six helpings a day. I use bread to make peanut butter sandwiches. Peanut butter is my favorite. Fruits and vegetables are next. Carrots are vegetables. I eat three helpings of vegetables every day. I eat two helpings of fruits, like apples, each day. Milk, cheese, and yogurt are dairy foods. I eat two helpings of dairy foods a day. I also eat two helpings of meat foods, like chicken, beans, eggs, or nuts. Click the close button or anywhere on the You can't stop now. We need to know the whole story before. I try not to eat sweet foods, and I don't eat many fatty foods. Wondering how much a helping is? My doctor told me how much was just right for me. Now I'm careful to eat the right amounts of everything. Can you dig it? Is bread a grain, vegetable, or dairy food? Is food grain. You have a nose for news. According to the story, name a vegetable. Carrots. Veg let's keep all vegetables. That's brilliant! That sentence is going into our store. What foods does Pierre not eat many of? He eat pizzas. It's a good sentence, but it just doesn't provide the answer we need. Facts. That's brilliant! That sentence is going into our store. What food does Pierre like most? Pierre. Peanut butter. Now that's 
a great news story. Bread is a grain food. Carrots are vegetable. He doesn't eat many fat. Pierre likes peanut butter. Oh, I couldn't have met my deadline without you. Please accept these power peanuts as a token of my appreciation. More story ideas are coming into the newsroom all the time. Do you want to do some more reporting? Story? Mr. Popularity. Frankie the dog is Mr. Popularity. Everybody likes him. He has many friends. One day, Pierre the bear said, I want to be popular like you. What's your secret, Frankie? It's no secret, said Frankie. I like to be treated right, so I'm nice to others. Is that all? asked Pierre. I don't cheat when I play games, and I share toys and books with my friends. It's good to take your time. I can do that, said Pierre. Sure you can, Pierre. It's easy to get along if you try. Then Pierre ran to the park to make new friends. What is Pierre? Pierre is a bear. You are a hard-hitting journalist. How does Frankie treat others? Frankie. Others is nice too. Oh, you captured what we need to say. What does Frankie not do when he plays games? Frankie does not cheat. That's brilliant. That sentence is going into our store. Where did Pierre run to make friends? Pierre ran to the park. We're going live with this store. Pierre is a bear. Frankie is nice to others. Frankie does not cheat. Pierre ran to the park. The sponsors will be more than happy to reward you with these power peanuts as a thank you for getting their commercial on the air. Do you want to stay here and write the news or go out there and make the news? Storybook. Nice and clean. Once upon a time, there was a girl named Keisha. Keisha was always nice and clean. She brushed her teeth every day. Keisha washed her hands and face with soap and water. She washed behind her big ears, too. One day, a green genie came to visit Keisha. The genie said, Keisha, I have heard that you are the cleanest girl in the land. I love to take baths, said Keisha. The genie replied, I see that your clothes are very clean, too. The genie waved his hand and he made a new set of paint colors for Keisha. For being so clean, I will reward you with these new paints. Keisha was very happy, and the first thing she painted was a picture of the genie. When does Keisha brush her teeth? Keisha. Day. Brushes. Every. Oh, you captured what we need to say. What does Keisha love to do? Keisha loves baths. Take two. Can you please try to arrange those words so they form a sentence that makes sense? You have a nose for news. How does Keisha clean her hands and face? Keisha. Soap. With. Wash it. That's brilliant. That sentence is going into our store. What does Keisha receive from the genie? Keisha. Paints. Let's keep paints. It's time for us to share this story with our viewers. Keisha brushes every day. 
Keisha loves to take bath. Keisha washes with soap. Keisha gets new paints. Oh, I couldn't have met my deadline without you. Please accept these power peanuts as a token of my appreciation. We're gathering more news, so I'd be most appreciative if you stay and s the plants. There are millions and millions of plants on Earth. They are found in every corner of the globe. Plants are living things. Most plants grow from seeds planted in the Earth, but some do not. Water lilies live in water, and orchids grow up in trees. Most plants have roots, a stem, leaves, and flowers or fruit. Roots take food for the plant from the soil. The stem holds the plant up. Leaves turn sunlight into food for the plant. And flowers or fruit make seeds for more plants. Plants are important to humans and animals. They provide foods like fruit, nuts, and vegetables. Trees give us wood for building. Plants, trees, and flowers also add beauty to our lives. Are plants living things? Plants are things living. That's brilliant! That sentence is going into our store. What do most plants grow from? Most plants grow from Seeds. Oh, you captured what we need to say. What plant foods do we eat every day? We. Vegetables. Eat. Fruits. And you are a hard-hitting journalist. What do roots do for plants? Roots take food from soil. We're going live with this store. Plants are living things. Most plants grow from seed. We eat fruits and vegetables. Roots take food from soil. We got the commercial on the air in time. Here's your reward. I hope you know that journalists work for Power Peanuts. We're gathering more new news. Baby animals born in the forest. Many animals live in the forest, and many of them had babies this year. Many animals live in caves or in nests or even in the ground, said Ranger Jim Hudson. A lot of them had babies in the spring. The bears had cubs, the deer had fawns. The rabbits and the beavers had babies too. There are many trees in the forest. Birds make nests in the trees. Then they lay eggs in the nests. Baby birds come from the eggs. A forest has lots of water, lots of food, and many places to hide. It's a good place for animals to live. The forest is full of new babies, said Ranger Hudson. Be quiet and careful, and maybe you can see them. Click the close button or anywhere on the screen. Who lives in the forest? Animals. Forest. In. In. The. Live. Oh, you captured what we need to say. What is a baby deer called? Uh. Baby. Deer. Fawn. Is. A. Uh. Oh, you captured what we need to say. What do birds make in the trees? Birds. Make. Nests. Oh, you captured what we need to say. Where do birds lay eggs? Birds. Nests. Lay. Eggs. Eggs. In. It's time for us to share this story with our viewers. Animals live in the forest. A baby deer is a fawn. Birds make nests. Birds lay eggs in nests. Oh, I couldn't have met my deadline without you. 
Please accept these power peanuts as a token of my appreciation. More story ideas are coming into the newsroom all the time. Stay on the lookout for news and come back here as soon as you find some. Bye! Scooter fever is running wild in Jumpstartville as we get our scooters and time to help Pierre practice scooting. This is Pierre's Polar Express test track. He likes to keep it a little chilly here, so I hope you're bundled up. Use the arrow keys on the keyboard to help Pierre collect snowballs in the correct order. When we have enough snowballs to build a snow bear, he'll give you a magic ice crystal power-up. The snowballs have pictures of items that are all different sizes. Steer Pierre to the smallest one first, and then work your way up to the largest. Fly, cat. Elephant, that's one. Three more to go. Collect the snowballs in the correct order, starting with the lowest number. 13, 14, 15. Your snow bear's halfway there. Let's try two more rounds. The snowballs will have pictures on them. First, steer Pierre towards the snowball with the earliest picture. Keep going until you reach the final picture. Birds live in the nest. Cool! The eggs hatch. The parents feed the babies. Pierre showed some fancy footwork that time. Only one more to go. The pictures on the snowballs show a series of events. Make Pierre grab the snowballs in the order that the events should take place. Put the ingredients in the bowl. Great skate scooting! Bake the cake. Finished cake. That's the last batch of snow we need for our snow bear. Here you go! Ah, oh, I can't wait to see what this magical crystal does for the scooters and tracks. I know it's cold, but if you want, we can put Pierre through his paces here at the test track again. Or we can go do something else. The snowballs will be numbered. You have to collect them in order, counting by tens. Think you can do that? 13. You're so cool, you're hot! 23. 33. That's one. Only three more to go. Hey, the numbers on the snowballs look like the ones on my racing trophies. They're called ordinals. Can you help Pierre collect them in order, starting with the lowest? Eight. Woo, you iced it. Twelve. 16. Your snow bear is halfway there. Let's try two more rounds. The snowballs have pictures of items that are all different lengths. Pierre should start with the shortest and end with the longest. Ant. Cool. Cat. Giraffe. Pierre showed some fancy footwork that time. Only one more to go. Collect the snowballs in the correct order, starting with the lowest number. Three, four, five. That's the last batch of snow we need for our snow bear. Woohoo! You can't lose with this magic ice crystal. I'm sure you're itching to know what that magic crystal does for your scooter. We can go to one of the shops or stay here and try out the track again. The snowballs will have pictures on them. First, steer Pierre towards the snowball with the earliest picture. Keep going until you reach the final picture. Birds live in the nest. The eggs hatch. The parents feed the babies. That's one. Only three more to go. The pictures on the snowballs show a series of events. Make Pierre grab the snowballs in... Are you sure you want to go back to the... Okay.
back to the game. In the order that the events should take place. Put mustard on the bread. Woo, you I Add the meat. Eat the sandwich. Your snow bear is halfway there. Let's try two more rounds. The snowballs will be numbered. You have to collect them in order. The flags change your curriculum skill level for the current game. Let's build another snow bear. Of course, first you have to help Pierre avoid all the polar perils long enough to gather snowballs. Steer Pierre toward the snowballs in the correct order, counting by fives. One. Cool! Six. Eleven. Great skate scooting! Oof! Sixteen. That's one. Only three more to go. Hey, the numbers on the snowballs look like the ones on my racing trophies. They're called ordinals. Can you help Pierre collect them in order, starting with the lowest? Fourth. Fourteenth. Your snow bear is halfway there. Let's try two more rounds. The snowballs have pictures of items that are all different sizes. Steer Pierre to the smallest one first, and then work your way up to the largest. Fly. Cat. <laughs> Elephant. Pierre showed some fancy footwork that time. Only one more to go. Collect the snowballs in the correct order, starting with the lowest number. Fifteen. Cool! 16. 17. That's the last batch of snow we need for our snow bear. This magic ice crystal is the coolest power up of them all. You know, the flags you can never have too many magic ice crystals. Let's build another snow bear. Of course, first you have to help Pierre avoid all the polar perils long enough to gather snowballs. Do you know what comes after 50? Well, you'll need to know that in order to steer Pierre to these snowballs with higher numbers. 51. Great skate scooting! 52. 53. You're so cool, you're a 54. 55. Woo, you are 56. 57, that's one. Only three more to go. The snowballs will have pictures on them. First, steer Pierre towards the snowball with the earliest picture. Keep going until you reach the final picture. Birds live in the nest. Cool! The eggs hatch. The parents feed the babies. Your snow bear is halfway there. Let's try two more rounds. The pictures on the snowballs show a series of events. Make Pierre grab the snowballs in the order that the events should take place. Put the ingredients in the bowl. Finished cake. Pierre showed some fancy footwork that time. Only one more to go. Steer Pierre toward the snowballs in the correct order, counting by fives. Two. You're so cool, you're a hot. Seven. Twelve. Woo, you iced it. Seventeen. Twenty-two. That's the last batch of snow we need for our snow bear. Ta-da! Why don't you warm up with some hot cocoa and this ice crystal power-up? Nice jamming with you.
scooter fever is running wild in Jumpstartville as we get our scooters and tracks calling all engineers. Hops needs help building a bridge. See that island over there? That's where I hide my supply of hyper carrots. Jimmy Bunkles would love to get his paws on them, but he doesn't know how to activate my blimp bridge. It's quite simple, really, as each blimp drops. Use your arrow keys to sort them into columns with similar items. When you drop enough blimps into each column, we'll be able to hop across the bridge and pick up that carrot fuel for the race. When we have the carrots, we've got to destroy the bridge. As the blimp flies out, look at the animal pictured on it and sort them by whether the animals fly, live in the water, or live on land. Whale. Whale. Nice sorting! Horse. Seal. Tiger. That blimp is going to land somewhere. Use the arrow keys on your keyboard. Okay, just a few more to go. Dolphin. Monkey. If you want to quit the game, use the go back arrow on the toolbar. is almost ours. Owl. Crow. B, are you still with me? We have to finish constructing the bridge if you want to get to the hyper carrots. Remember, the bridge is complete. Now sit tight while I go get a hyper carrot. This is a good place to hold the hyper carrots until we finish demolishing the bridge. Now we have to destroy the bridge in order to protect my carrots. The blimps that come out now are pop blimps. Use them to pop matching blimps that are already in the bridge. See more toolbar buttons. Shark. Lion. Power up is almost ours. That's good, that's good. Kangaroo. Giraffe. Nice sorting! Shrimp! Bat! Butterfly! We're really making some progress! Ha! Now if Jimmy wants to get my carrots, he's going to have to swim. Here's your power-up hyper carrot. You know, there's another carrot in it for you if you want to construct another bridge. You remember the secret to my bridge, don't you? The flags change your curriculum skill level for the current game. I'm a bright bunny, but even I'm amazed at how brilliant my secret bridge is. If you can't steer the blimps into the correct columns, then we can't get to my supercharged carrots. 
Use the arrow keys to steer the blimps into the columns so that they are sorted according to the shapes. Small green rectangle. Okay, just a few more to go. Green rectangle. Small red rectangle. Green circle. You're really making some progress. Red circle. Big red triangle. Blue circle. Okay, just a few more to go. Big yellow triangle. Small yellow triangle. This bridge is a masterpiece of construction. I'll just hop over and grab a hypercarrot. This is a good place to hold the hypercarrots until we finish demolishing the bridge. Now we have to destroy the bridge with pop limbs so that Jimmy doesn't steal my carrots. Small blue triangle. Small red circle. Small green circle. Big green. Nice sorting. Yellow circle. Small red triangle. Small nice sorting. Big red rectangle. That bridge is toast! Here is your hyper carrot. You're such a good builder. Why don't you stick around and earn some more carrots? Oh, you're leaving? Maybe I'll see you over at the races. It's a good thing you came back because we're still getting. Let's make pizza! You know what makes a good pre race meal? Pizza! Squirt will bring us orders from our race fans, and we'll use my pizza machine to make them. We'll divide the dough into sections, and then put the toppings on as they move to the oven on the conveyor belt. For each pizza you make correctly, I'll put a smoky dog biscuit on the tray. When you have four biscuits, you'll earn a power bone for the scooter race. How about a round pizza with... One quarter mushrooms. Three quarters pepperoni. That makes one quarter and three quarters. Mushroom. Pepperoni. Now that's a pizza. Ah, <sighs> smells great. Here's that bone I promised you. about a round pizza with one half mushrooms, one half pepperoni. That makes two halves. Mushrooms, pepperoni. Now that's a pizza. That one looks delicioso. Now you've got two bones. We're halfway there. How about a round pizza with one half mushrooms, one half anchovies? That makes two halves. Mushrooms, anchovies. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Thanks. Now that's what I call a pizza. With three bones, you're three quarters of the way there. How about a round pizza with 
One half olives. One half mushrooms. That makes two halves. Olives. Mushrooms. Now that's a pizza. Mamma mia! You've got all four bones. Hope you're not all worn out by all that baking, because we have got a race to win, and that power bone you earned is going to help. Let's do this again sometime. It's a good thing you came back, because we're still getting ready for the... Look out for alligators! We're off to the swamp! Frankie, you are indeed a great fellow! Braving the perils of the bog to help us gather swamp gas for the race! Yeah, well, anything I can do, as long as I don't have to get in that water. This swamp gas helps us fuel our scooters and tracks. I sure could use your help collecting some. It's okay by me, if it's okay by you. <laughs> a part of a word or math equation will pop up on the swamp gas machine. Bubbles will rise up from the bottom of the swamp. Use the arrow keys on your keyboard to steer CJ towards the bubble that contains the missing item, hit the space bar to help him capture it, then help him swim over to place the letter where it belongs. Use the space bar to release the bubble into the correct location. Add the numbers in the machine and find the bubble with the correct answer. Use the arrow keys to help CJ swim to the bubble you want to capture. Hit the space three. Three. That's one down. Let's finish three more. Eight. I'm hit. Eight. 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 What a gas! One. You did three already! I know you can do the last one. Five. Well, look at there! You finished a set and got a quarter bottle of swamp gas. Add the numbers in the machine and find the bubble with the correct answer. I love the smell of swamp gas in the morning! It smells like... Vic... Eight. That's one down! Let's finish three more. That was bubble-rific! Five. 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 You did three already! I know you can do the last one. Five. Now you've got half a bottle of swamp gas. Way to go! Add the numbers in the machine and find the bubble with the correct answer. Seven. Seven. That's one down. Let's finish three more. You're the Swamp Master!
one. You did three already! I know you can do the last one. Eight. Eight. Your bottle is three quarters of the way full. Keep it up! Add the numbers in the machine and find the bubble with the correct answer. Six. Six. That's one down. Let's finish three more. Six. Three. Hey, way to swim! can do the last one. Six. Six. Look at that. You've got a full bottle of stinky, slimy swamp gas power-up. <laughs> Congratulations. Click on the go back arrow if you want to leave. Otherwise, let's do it again. Welcome back. We're still in shock over the what time to get our scooters in gear. Let's add another gadget to one of the scooters. Good choice. Ready to add some gadgets? That peanut shield will come in hand. You can attach that gadget to your scooter. Nice choice. That gadget, it hops out, did himself, inventing those turbo bones. What a gadget. That's a great addition to this scooter. Oh, wow. I think you're going to need that snowball thrower. You can add that gadget to your scooter now. I couldn't have added a better gadget to this scooter myself. Did you see that? Click the you can add that gadget to your scooter. That gadget goes perfectly there. If you've got room on your scooter, you should get you can attach that gadget to your that gadget goes perfectly there. I've never seen anything like those carrot hover jets. If you what a gadget! I couldn't have added a better gadget to this scooter myself. With that soccer ball kicker, your scooter will be nearly uns. You can add that gadget to your nice choice. That gadget is sure to make this a better scooter. Scooter fever is... Are you ready for the big race? Start your engines! The suspense is building. We're almost ready for the big race. But before we go in, you need to pick a track and a racer. So, uh, who are we going to race with? I won't steer you wrong. Now, that track isn't ready yet. Remember, you need all eight tricks to unlock it. Let's get these tracks back to the shop. Hops put together this nifty machine that makes it easy to turn your power-ups into tricks to stick on the race tracks. Check out the tracks by clicking the pictures of our friends. Yeah! Let's add some tricks to this track. Power-ups have to go in the machine into my that ice loop will make the race really fun. Click the make it lever. Drag that trick onto a spot on the... You picked a perfect trick for this track. Wow! Eleanor's Peanut Gauntlet. Click the... Done! Now move the trick onto the track. I like the spot you chose for that. Well, Keisha's Paint Pits are a sweet little trick. Click... Now you're ready to move your new trick. I like the spot you chose... Sorry, you don't have any swamp gas. Click on the swap button if you... Imagine scooting down the track. The trick is made. Now you just have to... I like the spot you chose for that. Cool! Are you ready for the Robos? The trick is made. Now you just... I like the spot you chose for that trick. If I were you, I'd place at least one more trick on that track. Scooter 
fever is running wild in Jumpstartville as we... Are you ready for the big race? Start your engines! Through these do... I won't steer you wrong. Sorry, that track's still locked. You need to earn more tricks. Welcome back. Let's go shopping! I'm really glad you're back. The tracks could use more items. Let's shop! A can of seashells is just what we need now. That's the one. Now put the right amount of change in the machine. Quarter. Nickel. Quarter. Nickel. Penny. 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 Twelve cents. Can of seashells. I'll make sure Frankie knows you picked that out for his track yourself. Great job. Now you only need to buy three more track decorations. Can we buy that nice bridge? Windmill. Br Quarter. 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 Dime. 85 cents. Oh, you've got to count your coins better next time. Dime. 85 cents. Oh, you're too generous. You've put in... Close. Penny. Dime. 85 cents. Oh, you're too generous. You Dime. Nickel. Penny. 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 84 cents. Well... If that doesn't set Frankie's tail a wagon, then I'm a monkey's uncle. Two down, two to go. Why don't you buy the flower mound? Flower mound. Nickel. Quarter. Quarter. Nickel. Penny. Penny, 37 cents. Ooh, that's quite a bargain. I Flower mouth. Well, if that doesn't set Frankie's tail a wagon, then I'm a monkey's uncle. I see by the lights that you've only got to buy one more product before you get a power-up. Let's buy the bench, or I won't sit for this anymore. Let's buy the bench, or I won't sit for this anymore. Right, it's time to check out. Dime. Nickel. Penny. 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 Eight cents. Ben, I'll make sure Frankie knows you picked that out for his track yourself. Oh, what a fine job you've done. You've got four lovely decorations for the track. How's it feel to know you've earned that power up by your own labors? Business has been sort of slow, so if you want to stay a while longer, I'll be... It's a good thing you... Look out for alligators. We're off to the swamp. Use the arrow keys on your keyboard to steer CJ towards the bubble that's missing from the word or equation on the swamp gas machine. Help him capture it and place it in the correct spot. It looks like the word to spell is... Leg. Eh. Eh. That's one down. Let's finish three more. It looks like the word to spell is... It. The word to spell is he. Eh.
You did three already! I know you can do the last one. It looks like the word to spell is... Job. J. Now, you've got to move these four words around to put them in alphabetical order. If you want to quit the game, use the go back arrow on the toolbar. Put these words in alphabetical order and you'll earn some swap gas. Well, look there! You finished a set and got a quarter bottle of swamp gas. It looks like the word to spell is... Mad. Ah. Ah. That's one down. Let's finish three more. It looks like the word to spell is... On. like the word to spell is run. You did three already! I know you can do the last one. It looks like the word to spell is net. in alphabetical order, and you will earn some swamp gas. Now that you've filled in all the gaps, you need to put them in order. Now you've got half a bottle of swamp gas. Way to go! It looks like the word to spell is... Sad. three more. It looks like the word to spell is N. Hmm. That was bubble -rific. It looks like the word to spell is two. Ah. You did three already. I know you can do the last one. It looks like the word to spell is... Bed. Eh. Can you and CJ put these four words in alphabetical order? Your bottle is three quarters of the way full. Keep it up! It looks like the word to spell is... Go! That's one down! Let's finish three more! It looks like the word to spell is... Four! Ah! That was bubble -rific. It looks like the word to spell is... Do. Whoopsie, you caught the wrong bubble. Duh. Duh. You did three already! I know you can do the last one. It looks like the word to spell is... Cat. to move these four words around to put them in alphabetical order.
look at that. You've got a full bottle of stinky, slimy swamp gas power-up. <laughs> Congratulations. Welcome back. We're still in time to get our scooters in gear. Time to give your scooters that extra edge by turning your power-ups into... It'll be cool to see these scooters in action on the tracks. Let's go! Through these doors walk the finest... We can always use some more track tricks. Your tracks are getting trickier all the time. Good choice. Ready to add some track tricks? Wait, you can't put that there. If you think your scooter skills are... Now you're ready to move your new trick. That's a great add-on for this track. Click the make it lever if you think the trick is made. You picked a perfect... Well, that's a drag. You don't have that one. Welcome back. Let's make pizza. Hey there. Let's help Squirt get the pizzas for the race fans. How about a round pizza with one quarter mushrooms, three quarters olives? That makes one quarter and three quarters. Mushrooms, olives, olives. That looks perfect. Thanks. Ah, <sighs> smells great. Here's that bone I promised you. How about a round pizza with one quarter gummy worms, one quarter mushrooms, one half olives? <laughs> that makes two quarters and a half. Gummy worms, olives, mushrooms. Oh, yummy, yummy, yummy. Thanks. That one looks delicioso. Now you've got two bones. We're halfway there. How about a round pizza with one quarter green peppers, three quarters olives? That makes one quarter and three quarters. Green peppers, olives. Oh, yummy, yummy, yummy. Thanks. Now that's what I call a pizza. With three bones, you're three quarters of the way there. How about a round pizza with one half gummy worms, one half green peppers? That makes two halves. Gummy worms, green peppers, Yummy, yummy, yummy. Thanks. Mamma mia! You've got all four bones. Hope you're not all worn out by all that baking, because we have got a race to win, and that power bone you earn is going to help. If you want to play again, I'm game. Welcome back. Are you ready for the big race? Start your engines! Listen, we can always use some more track tricks. Pick a track. Then drag a power-up into the machine and click on the... Yeah! Let's add some tricks to this track. That dish of old dog food will make a great track trick. If you like it, click drag that trick onto a spot on the track. You picked a perfect trick for this track. Welcome back. Are you ready for the big race? Start your engines! Through these
these doors wide. I won't steer. You'll love my track. Yeah, I want to show Jimmy we can win on his turf too. But we have to beat him on all the other tracks before we can race on his. Hurry, the race is about to start. This is it, it's race time. Oh, but let me tell you how to work your scooter first. Use the arrow keys on the keyboard to steer. Hit the space bar when you want to use the gadget that's showing on the dashboard at the bottom. If you don't have the gadget, you'll have to do your best to get through the next obstacle that comes along. Three, two, one, go! What an exciting race! Now, let's sing the praises of the winners. When you've got a faithful friend by your side, how can you lose? Surely that's why you and Frankie won this race. Well, everyone, settle down, sit back, and watch the lovely award show. You know, you can always create one of your own with Keisha later if you like. One to gossip, mind ya, that Jimmy Bumbles wasn't too keen on losing the race. I think he's going to challenge you when you get back to the race prep arena. Just wanted to give you a heads up, since you're a pal. You were lucky. If we were racing on my track, you would have been choking on my dust. But since you think you're so hot, why don't you take me on? Come on, back at the track, you and me for the championship. Yeah, I want to show Jimmy we can win on his turf, too. Uh, but we have to beat him on all the other tracks before we can race on his. Go back, Arrow. You need to select a track and a racer before we go in the arena. Scooter Fever is running. Are you sure you want to quit? Click Yes to leave the game. Click No to go back to the game. Click the Change Players button if you want to sign in as a new player. Quit the game. Bye-bye.